Hi friends, in this video I'm showing you how to use auto numbering in AutoCAD. Here I'm numbering for a car parking slots. However, you can use same method for any other situations. Please watch this video till the end because I have included many other tips in this video. And please subscribe, like and comment your suggestion for this video. This is the car parking area that I'm going to add numbering for each parking slots. All these parking slots are individual blocks. The benefit of making blocks that we can take total count of parking slot very easily by select similar and properties. Also if you need to add wheel stopper for example, you can add it for one and it will reflect for all. Add a text and adjust the size. Now select any block and right button edit block editor in place and add working set and select the text to get inside to the block. Now the text inside the block. Now we can properly arrange justification I'm giving here middle center and pick and right button mid between two points and opposite two corners and it will be on middle center of the parking slot now close the block editor save and close now you can see the text updated for all the parking slots now select all the block by select similar and copy a specific distance now I'm um, giving 150 to up and explode these blocks then we will get number numbers will be separated okay now exploded all numbers are separated now we are going inside the block editor and remove this text okay save and close and now here we can select similar all the text and move back to the specific distance 150. Now we can delete this. Now we have parking slot separate and the numbers are separate. Here you can see some text uh, rotation is wrong that because of the block mirror. It's okay we can select similar and give the proper rotation for all the text. Now here we can see how to add text for parking slot if it's not blocks by using copy with array. Select text and copy command and choose the base point and select array and give the count. Here I have 40 slots horizontally and show the distance. And now we can copy all these two sections for bottom parking slots by using same copy with array. Here we have four items all together and type the four and give it to the distance. Select auto number from express tool. Also you can type the command t count and it will ask for select object. Now just type f on keyboard and enter for getting fence selection and numbering will start this selected order. Draw fence top on each text.
and after the selection right button and enter and enter again and here we can choose selected order so the numbering increment will uh, start from the selected order and here we can type start number first and comma then the increment increment we need to start one two three so the next we can type one and press enter we have four options are here and now I'm choosing find and replace I'm keeping the letter P and replace numbering with this XXX so here I can type XXX and press enter now you can see the text are numbered properly and now you can notice that P1 to P9 is 2 digit and P10 to P99 is 3 digit and remaining all are 4 digit we can make it all 4 digit by finding and replace with letter P find P with replace P00 and select text up to P9 and replace all now P1 to P9 is 4 digit and now we can change P10 to P99 that P with P0 select P10 to P99 and find replace now you can see all the text are four digit and now I will show you different method auto numbering type T count and select all these text and enter now we can choose X order so the increment will start X X order before we did selected order okay now starting number we have to continue the previous one 320 so this will be 321 and increment will be 1 and enter and here we can choose overwrite we don't want to keep P in this situation so you can see how we can overwrite for numbering this text we can choose suffix method for that let me keep only P for these text select the text and control one for properties and select text for from here and change the content with P and enter click on auto number and select the text and choose X and now we have to continue with the number 360 so 361 comma increment will be 1 and enter now we can choose here suffix okay now the suffix added the numbering at the end of the text here we have space with after P so we can remove that find and replace find space with replace empty and replace all okay now the space was removed thank you for watching this video please like this video and subscribe my channel and please comment your feedback and suggestions for this video thank you